Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Strata Deep. You gotta admit, you really do like that new intro. I know they ripped it off from GTA, but yeah, it's still pretty cool. Aha, day 48. By the way, this is the second time I'm actually recording this. Uh, needless to say, I got lost. And lo lost, and I ran out of fuel, and the gyrocopter came splashing down into the water. And I was still lost. So I had to go back to the last video and actually figure out where I'm supposed to be going. Uh, but I have done my inventory management. That's all we got there. I picked up a whole bunch of sticks too, just for what we're going to do today. Uh, what I want to do today is uh, I actually want to uh, start working on the old homestead a little bit. Try to figure out which way we're going to like start expanding, get like a wharf set up for our new uh, new raft. Now, I originally had gotten lost. Like, I looked back at my video and I was trying to figure out where I was going. Now, I was saying I had this thing pointed in the direction I was supposed to go. But I started heading south-southwest before. And honestly, I have no idea where my island is. But, yeah, so the plans are to, you know, start working on the house. Have a better place to uh, dock the boat, the raft. And eventually I want to start upgrading that raft. Uh, I want to start expanding the sides out and so on and so forth. And like I said, I want to take on the, the Megalodon. Uh, not only with expanding the raft, uh, I want to make it dual powered so I can have it, so I can use the rudder and the sail, but also use the engine if I want to. It's if I had the fuel for it. Uh, and not only that, but it allows me to add more storage shelves to it so I can actually get more storage. Carry more things, take more things home with me. Sorry, I was just looking off into the distance trying to find out where my home is. Now, I know it's not this one. I'm pretty sure this is where we f found Wilson because I can sort of see the canopy there. Or maybe it was a floating rock. I have no idea. But I think it might be this one. I have no idea. We'll have to check. I do have a little bit of fuel. But... See, I go by... Which marker was it? It was that one I think we were just at. Actually, is it? Oh, yeah, there is actually a fuel gauge on this thing. I didn't even see that on the left there. Sure burned through it pretty quick, though. But yeah. Is that one there? I go by that mass beyond the far right. There should be a small container there. Which could mean this is home. Or maybe that's home. This could be home. Of course, nothing's drawn in yet, but I will land. I'm going to pull up the spyglass and see if we can actually see something. There's junk on the ground, but that doesn't mean anything. Oh, I see some planks, but I don't think I have the room for it. But let's go ahead and line this thing. Carefully. Oh, thank God. I can actually pick it up. That's good to know. All right. Now, what do we have over here? That's not my island. Is that my island? No, that's my marker. Yeah, I think... Honestly, I think that's it there. Or it could be that one. Yeah, it'd be nice if you could actually see the things. I know they have a level of detail and all. But that's besides the point. I'm just going by what I see on this island here. 
this island. We take a look. No, not that island. That's not the island I'm looking for. It's this one over here. And this is... Oh, that's a snake. Just because I have po an antidote on me doesn't mean I go running around getting poisoned. But it was... I've lost my reference point. There it is. Okay, this island here. And that mast should be on the right, but I think there should be a small container here I can also see. So that's why I think the islands... Our island's got to be more or less right here. Unfortunately, I don't think I've been here before, so I haven't left any markers, or I haven't left any markers. A lot of good stuff, though. Not much you can really take, though. I don't have the inventory space. So now the question is, which one is it? I know I got a rock on my island. I want to say it's that one. So we're going to have to chance it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a cut here and I'll bring you back when I, if I find it or not. Okay, well, it's been, uh, needless to say, a couple of reloads, but I think I see it. I think it's over there. Do you see something glittering? I could be wrong, though. Because I don't see any rocks, but from what I've seen in the video, I do have a couple of small rocks. I'm on my, 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 my island. The problem is, though, is uh, my whole tanker idea. There's actually two tankers. So that could be an issue. What do we got here? That's the old house. Well, where did we, where did I move? Did I go further than that? Where was that island again? Over there. I am so legitimately lost right now. It's not even funny. But the only thing I can know is I do have some big, uh, a big rock and a smaller rock. And I don't think that's it either. I'm more or less at the point where I'm going to brute force it. Load up, fly in a certain direction until I find it. If I don't find it, move on. See, now there's that tanker there. But the one that I saw from my island, there's another one here. But where is that other tanker? You know what I mean? That's not it. This wasn't a video game and this was the real world. I'd be dead by now. Guaranteed. Well, technically I should have been dead three times over already, but... You know, for recording purposes. I am so lost. It is not funny. I'll have to bring you back. Well, I'll be. I found it. Uh, the reason why I was getting lost is I didn't realize I had gone <coughs> west a little bit to one island. So I had to backtrack east to come back to the main island. I just kept it going straight northeast. Three islands, and there she is. Our, our little, little shack and a paradise island there. Uh. Well, anyways, uh, that is good. So what I'll do is I'll bring you back when uh, it's time to land, and then we'll go check on the farms. Okay, finally we're back. Well, first order of business. Empty out our pockets. Get all this stuff out of the way. Oh my god, I forgot how, I forgot how much stuff I had. Oh, we got another lantern. That is cool. But yeah, as you can see, I got a whole bunch of sticks and 
whatnot, but we gotta go take care of our uh, farms here, make sure everything's still alive. Ooh, potatoes. Take that, take that, take that, take that. Now that's pretty good because we've already gone for a couple of days. And I think, I think I actually had another potato. But we're gonna get, that, get those on the steel right now. I need fuel. Uh, it's another thing I gotta look for too is uh, try to see if I can find more of those jerry cans. Because those are gonna be very important for keeping this thing running. And I really hope to do come out with a different fire starting mechanic. This is really annoying. <laughs> it's about the only thing that's annoying in this game. Other than the night snakes. But we don't have the night snakes anymore. Okay, that is going good. How am I doing? I'm good. I'm fine. I had some rations on the other island there. Look at all these yuccas. Oh, man. We got fibers for days. I saw the... Uh, flower just happened to line up with the crates and I thought they were pink for some reason. Don't ask me why. But I do have a, I do have another um, potato somewhere. I'll grab the pippy and put that away. And uh, all the water stills are good. Oh, look at that. I still got a whole bunch of fibers there too. Anyways, uh, let me water the plants to take care of this and I'll bring you back. Okay, so I got uh, got all the plants taken care of. I do have to water the yuccas a little bit more. That one plant did die again, but you know, there's not much I can do about it. But what I want to do is go ahead and make some make some lashings. Grab a whole bunch of those fibers out of that creek there because I had so many. I just had to harvest, and I know I got three on my island I can harvest, so we are good. So now let's go ahead and find some sticks. Of course my inventory is full. Ah, the pippy can go away. Actually, didn't I not have any more pippy? Hang on. Alright, some more stuff here. I got more taters there. That's good. Aha. Bring on the snakes. I'll drink their venom. Probably die horribly in the process, too. Hmm. Well, since we have that... Oh, wait. Flasks. Go ahead and make two more antidotes, shall we? And it's not going to show up in there, of course. Antidote. And. Oh, I don't have enough for another antidote. Uh, get me out of here, please. Uh, thank you. Okay, we'll put that away and let's stick that in the first new kit with. Uh, Do I not have any more pit pee on me? Oh yeah, I have it all there. We might as well make it to the roof while we can. Just because we can. And it's always good to have it. As long as, as, long as we're somewhere near a home. Really? I don't know if we're in my inventory. Oh, this room. Okay, there we go. Go grab some more sticks. And I think we might actually start doing that. Start expanding uh, that a little bit. Uh, where are those sticks? There they are. So, yeah, I want to, like I said, I want to get some sort of pier going here. And I'm not really sure where I want to build it. I do need a hammer somewhere. Where, oh, where can a hammer be? Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Tools? Oh, no, 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 no. Be in the toolbox. Uh, we can actually put these away. I don't need them anymore. We'll grab that. And we run out here. Okay. Sort of, I want to have it lined up with this if I can. That works. That should work. It better work. Yeah, too many things to quick out. Wait, what is this? Oh yeah, the fishing rod. I forgot about that. Alright, building. Uh, we'll go with... Uh, yeah, it's going to be wood foundation. 
and I don't want it too high, but I don't want it too low either. So I don't want it that low, but that's about there. It could work. And of course, it's going to take a painfully long time. And of course, I do realize that I didn't actually need lashings for these. So it is getting dark. I do have a few more plants I got to water and some other chores I got to do. But uh, oh, that's not what I want to do. I'm going to continue building this out and I'll bring you back when. I guess I'll bring you back in the morning. I'll be working on this for a little bit. Sun is going down and I got to get down a whole bunch of trees. Anyway, I shall return. Okay, I'm back. I decided to check on the plants there to see, make sure they're still doing okay. Uh, I had another one of the yuccas die, which means we're going to have to go get, pick up some clippings, but you know, by the looks of this place, I got more of the, more than these, more than enough of these young palm trees than I'll ever need. Too bad they don't actually grow under the big trees. That's besides the point. But anyways, this is what I got set up. So I, this is sort of like up here, I'm going to gonna go along. I uh, ended up being a little higher than I wanted it to be, but oh well, what can we do? Now let's see what happens if we can actually bring this thing up in here. Oh, okay. Uh, we'll raise the anchor. Let's do back her up. And... Okay, I was trying to figure out why I'm not turning. does not want to turn, is that what's going on? I know I have the sail up, so I shouldn't be causing an issue. Hello, Sharky. But basically, this is all I want is somewhere where I can actually park this thing and actually jump. Why is this not steering properly? It must have something to do with uh, the sail, maybe? I swear to God, I know how to drive. Mm -hmm. Just not a raft. Something is seriously up with this thing. Good thing I got some fuel on me. Actually, you know what? Let's do that. How much does that actually use? That uses a full tank. A separate spice. Alright, let's go around. We were around because I could have sworn the turning radius on this thing was a lot more than what it was. Turning radius are about half a mile by the looks of it. I wonder if that sail's got something to do with it. Is it up or down? Because that could be bugging me out because, you know early access, what can I say? So clearly when I come up to this dock, I'm going to have to make sure I get clear alignment with it. Watch out for Sharky, watch out for the other boats that are shipwrecked on my island. And that's one way to get, one way to turn around. Just clip something. Let's not beach it. Not yet. Oh my god, this is got to be the raft, or the, the sail. Well, there you have to go. Uh, clearly, I put this in the wrong plot, this place. But I'm sure it's just a matter of figuring out how to steer this raft. I know it should be left, right, left, right, but it doesn't want to do that for me. Sure, that'll work. Just the time for shark music. And now, now if I actually make the jump, <laughs> you get the idea. Like realistically, I should be driving it straight in. Wow. Okay. 
you get the you get the drift. I should be able to jump on that thing, but for some reason I can't steer that raft properly. But another thing I want to do, and this is just to help me see it at night, is uh, do I have sticks on me? I do not. Which means I have to go to cut down another tree. And I think I had in the logs somewhere, or some sticks maybe. Did I actually have a box with sticks in it? I don't think I did. Planks, cock, oh yeah. Everything but sticks. Fuel, huh? Oh! Sticks. I knew I had sticks somewhere. Actually, I'm probably need a couple more. For the idea I want to do for this. Yeah, it was uh, something I've done before, too. Uh, there's one other thing I need to get. Something we picked up on our little misadventure there. Where are you? There you are. Now we actually have sort of a, a little of a, I won't say a beacon, but at least something we can see when we're coming up so we at least know, our, know it's our island. So we're going to go to the building menu, we're going to go back here, we're going to do a door frame. And what we're going to do is put it there and go ahead and finish this up. Like so, uh, is this going to be in the quick craft? No, it's not. Alright, so now we go back to crafting. We make ourselves... Where is it here? Where is it? Is it not actually in here? It's gotta be. Yeah, it's furniture. We will place a hook right up. Sure. It's even enough that we can hang that off there. So now we have a little guiding light when we're coming in from from the nighttime. It's kind of a shame this guy doesn't jump too well. It's kind of actually a kind of a shame. I can't even drive this thing properly to line it up with the dock. But. Let's see if we can actually make this jump. Not quite. Anyway, I will bring you back in the morning. Okay, I am back. Uh, so, yeah, I did a little bit of organizing, put everything away that should be put away, and uh, whatnot. Checked on the plants again. They seem to be okay. I probably should have something to eat, but uh, we can hold off on that for now, because what we're going to do is we're going to actually do something I've been meaning to do for a while. Let's make the sleeping bag. So I need three sticks, three cloth, and three leather. Three leather. One, one, two, three. Uh, three cloth. One, two, three. And three sticks. It always helps when you have, it, have things actually organized. All right. Uh, what's going on here? Why is this not put, we put it down? Oh, it's not actually the sleeping bag, it's, it's an actual bed. This is the bed we used to have, so I'm just going to drop you right here. And the best thing is, we can actually take this everywhere we go, I think. I never checked if we can actually build a shelter on the raft, but I'm pretty sure we can put this on the raft and have this for as we go. So there we go, I have a new save point. A portable save point too, I do believe. But I think we're probably going to end the episode here. Uh, I'm going to have to do a lot of the resource gathering to get this house finished. Uh, I am going to keep the potatoes running so we have some fuel. And I'm thinking about the gyrocopter too. I might have to set up some sort of landing pad for that. Just it's, uh, What I've noticed when you take off with the gyrocopter, whatever angle it's on, it stays on. You can't really adjust it mid-flight unless I rebind it ton of keys and I don't want to do that and I was way off on this thing but that's okay you know why because we're stranded on a deserted island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean just waiting for the next storm to show up and blow us away
But anyways, I think I think we're gonna call this one here. I didn't really get too too much done. I was trying to find my way back home, and so I mean about getting lost and trying to leave markers like this, so at least you know which direction you gotta go and pay attention to the map. But what I want to do eventually is start expanding. Uh, that raft a little more like I was saying, get a little bit more space, get one more on either side and extend it one more and try to get some more shelving on there. So it'll basically be five wide here and then go two more. And so two more here, another one here, and then probably one more at the front. So we'll add another what, seven sections, day 50. Uh, yeah, seven sections and then get some more shelvings on there and then probably leave the sail and the, the anchor there um, but th thinking about the anchor if I, if I expand one more on either side here I could probably leave the motor in the middle I could put the rudder here and the anchor I could probably put the, the rudder here and leave the anchor there so that way I can access the anchor from the, the motor and yeah, and then, uh, you know, there's different things I want to do. I want to uh, try to take on this Megalodon. That's going to be the fun one. Uh, but I also want to try to do my own mapping of these islands. Try to figure out where everything is, because I'm getting lost all the time, and that kind of sucks. But anyways, I think we're going to call this one here. I thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave me a like, and as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later. <laughs>